now i am giving information about india's venus mission and the second project with sweden sweden is getting on board india's venus orbiter mission sukrayaan with a scientific instrument to explore the planet ambassador of sweden to india kas molin said swedi swedish institute of space physics that is irf is engaged in the venture its second collaborative project with the indian space research organization irf's satellite instrument venusian neutrals analyzer that is vna will study how the charged particles from the sun interacted with the atmosphere and exosphere of the planet the new venus mission means that the collaboration between irf and isro continues the vna would be the ninth generation of irf series of miniature ion and ena ena means energetic neutral atoms instruments according to swedish officials the first generation was named sara that means sub kg5 atom reflective sorry reflecting analyzer and was launched on board the indian spacecraft chandrayaan 1 that explored the moon in 2008 and 2009 sara consisted of two sensors one was a detector for energetic neutral atoms and the other was an instrument to measure the flow of ions in the solar wind the instrument studied how the plasma around the moon interacts with the moon where the surface is not protected by an atmosphere or a magnetic field for the first time ever sara could investigate energetic atoms that are knocked from the lunar surface when they are hit by the solar wind the sara experiment was the first collaborative project between irf and the isro on collaboration in general with india in the field of space has quite a lot of lot to provide both from its institutions and from space check companies further molin said india has a clear ambition to explore the universe other planets and to send humans to space so sweden is very very much interested to join uh, to explore uh, venus and uh, find uh, find the energetic Uh, neutral atoms uh, and uh, detect it and the other was an instrument to measure the flow of ions in the solar wind with the collaboration with isro whenever isro had a joint venture with other nations definitely we are getting foreign exchange uh, and uh, further we can uh, proceed and succeed more in the field of space research sweden joins india's venus mission with a tool to explore this planet on successfully launched on 25th november 2020 successfully